insert very offensive gag here. What is up, my homies? Today, we are going over some Goose Pump YouTubers. Hooray! So, if you read the title, we're talking about specifically underrated Goose Pump YouTubers. Some YouTubers that don't give enough, well, don't receive enough love. And, honestly, they're awesome. All of them. And, to be clear, we're not going over a whole bunch of popular YouTubers, because those are very well known, like Aussie Fan. You're not going to be on here because you're so loved and we love you and like michael goosebump fan or um more recently red wonder 8 and anybody over like a thousand subs i'm counting as more of a appreciated use on youtube or someone's popular um or anybody near that mark but today we're gonna be talking about some youtubers that really need enough like a lot more love and they have great content starting with um a very interesting one indeed so, without further ado, let's get into it. Herge. So the first of these YouTubers is Monster Blood. You know, Monster Blood is probably was really underappreciated. Um, I feel like um their videos are pretty decent, and he's basically just reviewing all the Gizmo books. And honestly, he has some uh, great videos out there. And if you're looking for a book review of a book you like, he's the only place to go because he's probably reviewing. Reviewed it. If you're looking for someone who isn't Michael Guzman fan, since I bet everybody's at least watched their favorite book review on there. I know I have. But, uh, yeah. He makes some great book reviews. Um, also, love him in general. He's, a uh, he's great. He's funny. And, yeah, overall, a nice channel. Next up, we have Frizzard17. So, this guy does some, well, fortunately, during unboxing, so I guess that might be his type of content. Um, he also does book reviews and episode reviews, so, yeah, um, if you're looking for a review, you might do one there, but I will, uh, say he is more of a recent Goosebump YouTuber, um, he joined August of last year, so, yeah, he is a little more recent, so he doesn't have as much as subscribers, and he's not he's as popular as a lot of, uh, other YouTubers are gonna be on this list, so I recommend, um, hitting that subscribe button on his channel, please, I am begging you, he does... Well, he's probably going to get some great content out. And he already does pretty great videos. Um, and apparently, his, um, the quality of his videos will improve when he reaches 400 subs. Says the bio. He already has a lot of videos as well. So, yeah. I recommend him. And how could I not include the Slappy789? Now. I know what you're thinking. Like, this doesn't look like a useful channel. If you're not aware. I mean, you can already see down in the, doctor, in the bottom corner. This guy... He is making a Goosebump Plus show. And, of course, one of the people I mentioned at the beginning of this video, Red Wonder 8, is going to be sent in the universe that he has created. But, uh, yeah, he's actually working on two a prequel series and, of course, his own series, which I uh, can't remember if it is canon or not. But, yeah, I'm currently working on a Goosebump Plus show, and, yeah, it's pretty interesting. YouTube has got some funny videos as well. And he's been teasing a lot of his content recently. And, uh, yeah, I definitely do recommend him. So next up, we have Bumps in the Night. Bumps in the Night is actually a fairly, uh, old Goosebump YouTuber. Um, I wouldn't say old exactly, but, I mean, yeah, kind of. Anyways, um, his, his channel is a little old. There we go, that's what I meant to say. So, um, he used to be called Goosebumps Now, and he did a lot of thrift videos. So if you like thrift videos, you can go back and those, watch those. Those are always fun. Um... But he actually has been doing some reviews and paranormal stuff recently. Um, actually, there might be a video coming up about my paranormal experience, which I might bother to tell if anybody's curious. Or more. So, I live in a, I, I, I'm not even kidding when I say I live in a haunted house, but that's enough about me. This guy is awesome. Um, some of the best some content I've seen in a long time. Um, and I love the channel banner up there. It's really nice. And of course, just... Just highly recommend him. Come on, guys, please. Next up is Haunted Goosebumps. Now, they haven't uploaded in a while, but they do do uh, Goosebumps unboxing and stuff. Um, of course, collection updates, as you can see in the description there. And overall, they are probably the, yeah, they are the least subscribed one on here, so please go subscribe to them. Of course, uh, I don't know if they're actually coming back to YouTube. Um, I'm not quite sure. But uh, yeah, they've been gone for a little bit, so... Yeah, I thought I'd just recommend it. In case they do come back, they'll have a little surprise point for them if they do get a good sub boost. But yeah, I do recommend them. I mean, the videos that are already on there are pretty good. And this guy is basically the reason I made this video. 
in closet goosebumps fan is one of the best goosebumps i have seen and he's not even the last one here the next one is genuinely awesome um not more awesome than him yeah i don't know these guys the guy next um possibly people are actually on the same level as this dude and i just want to say this guy is like michael goosebumps fan um, amazing voice. I love listening to his videos. He has a little podcast series that he did, which was actually genuinely entertaining, especially, um, one of his least viewed ones on that podcast, surprisingly, because it was actually one of my favorite ones on there. But, uh, yeah, um, he's been actually recently talking about the resurrection thing, um, shows down there. Um, Goosebumps Leaks for Goosebumps Resurrection, or at least that's a working title, so I can freely say that since that is not the official title quite yet. It might be, but you never know. There's many titles going around. But yes, um, there's a lot of leaks going around for Goosebumps. Um, Disney Plus, if you haven't been aware. And they're basically real. I don't see reason why to even just say they're possibly real. They're just, they're real. Honestly, I, I can't even deny it anymore. It's so, it's probably, if not, I would be dead shocked. Because they are so, they, they, okay. Enough about that. There's a video coming about that soon. Um, yeah, I love this guy. Seriously. Um. One of the best channels of Goosebumps I actually have ever seen. Um, top 10 for me. Actually, top 5, honestly. Um, amazing content. Um, very funny. One of my favorite videos he's ever done is Defending That Green Slime. And of course, with that one, uh, his podcast. Podcasts are underrated. But yeah, very, very, very underrated. Please go sub to him. And honestly, look at that video count. He's actually going to pass me if he keeps this up. And last but not least... Goosebumps the series. Okay, last but not least, Goosebumps the series. I absolutely love this channel. Not only do they have some of the best Goosebumps skits, well, not exactly skits, but remakes or episodes I've ever seen, they're literally a series. It's not even a joke in the title. They are dead set on making a bunch of Goosebumps book adaptations. And not only that, but they're making their own Goosebumps stories, like Vampire in the Neighborhood. I think that's one of the ones that they did for season two, I think. And uh, yeah, it's so awesome. I actually genuinely enjoyed all their videos. Um, even some of the ones that are a little, you know, not as big budget, if there even was a budget exactly. Um, if not, I would be genuinely shocked. It's pretty good. Um, especially their Mr. Wood one. Some of the ones like Revenge of the Lawn Gnomes, though they aren't that good quality lies, they're still entertaining. All of their videos are entertaining, especially, of course, previously mentioned Mr. Wood. Um, and of course, um, they, uh, if you if you're looking down there, yeah, you can see if they've been gone for a little bit. I'm like, I'm hoping they're just filming the show and they haven't had time to upload a teaser, or they're gonna be releasing like some big bang or some shit, and they're gonna come out with like. I don't know, a full-blown movie. I mean, Mr. Wood was already, like, an hour, or, or almost, like, nearly an hour, I think. Or at least it was, like, the average time of a special, like, 40 minutes. But, yeah, it was pretty long for that. So, I wouldn't be surprised if they come out with something crazy. Of course, maybe, like, all the episodes are being recorded at once, and they're all going to release, like, every week. Like, that would be awesome. But, yeah, very excited to see what else they have cooking, if they are going to come back. And if, if not, genuinely just go check out their channel. They have some awesome videos. So that is going to do it for this video. Um, please subscribe to every single one of those channels previously mentioned. Um, especially the last two in Closet Goosebumps and Goosebumps series. Very awesome people. Um, absolutely love their content. Of course, give, uh, give the others some love, you know? I mean, I subscribe to every Goosebumps channel I see that isn't just like, um, oh, I made one Goosebumps video. Or, oh, I, uh, I, my name is Goosebumps channel and I, I never upload a video. <laughs> I mean, I do maybe subscribe to them if there's potential. But, uh, yeah, um, please go subscribe to them. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Jay Station Outro, here I come. Peace!